KIOCL Limited, India's premier pelletizing and pigarden complex. KIOCL Limited, a flagship company under the Ministry of Steel, was established on 2nd April 1976 to mine, beneficiate, and export iron ore concentrates from Kudremuk deposits. KIOCL is engaged in the production of iron oxide pellets and foundry grade pig iron suitable for domestic as well as international markets. The raw material iron ore procured from Bellari region is transported through rail route to its captive railway marshalling yard at the New Mangalore port area. The ore received by rail and ships is stored in two covered storage sheds, each of 2 lakh tons capacity. The iron ore is conveyed to ball mills through silo and bunkers for screening through primary screens, grinding and filtration. Two of the three ball mills are operated at a time in a closed circuit grinding. Each ball mill is maintained at 250 tons per hour feed rate. The ground slurry is then passed through derrick screens for final separation and pumped to dewatering cyclones. The slurry is then pumped to two agitator tanks of 7,500 ton capacity each. The slurry is filtered through vacuum disc filters and also horizontal pressure filters to get filter cake of moisture 11% and 8.5 to 9.5% respectively. The filter cake thus produced is conveyed to the storage shed through a series of conveyors.
the filtrate generated during the filtration process is sent to thickener for recovery of water used for various processes. The entire plant operations are controlled through computer control system at port facilities and pellet plant. Additives like bentonite, limestone and coke are ground at the given ratio or mixed with iron ore filter cakes. The mixed material is then conveyed to the day bins. Day bins will feed mixed material to boiling discs, which are inclined at 47 degree with 7.5 meter diameter. The discs can produce 140 to 160 tons of green pellets per hour. These green balls are screened through primary roller screens and then double decker roller screen to get correct size of 9 to 16 mm. Unsized pellets are sent back for processing. Correct sized green pellets are then fed to the furnace which has a reaction area of 492 square meters. In the furnace, the pellets are gradually fired up to 1320 degrees Celsius to get the desired physical properties like CCS of about 250 kg per pellet. These pellets are screened for correct size before conveyed to the stockyard through conveyor system. The pellet stockyard can accommodate approximately 2.5 lakh tons. The pellets are loaded through a mechanized loading system which includes boom type reclaimer and ship loader of the capacity of 6000 tons per hour. A captive iron ore berth has been provided to handle ships of 65,000 dry weight ton with loaded draught of 12.5 meter. With the provision of an exclusive berth, waiting time for ships is eliminated. KIO Seal has installed captive power plant consisting of three diesel generator sets of 9.36 megawatt capacity each using furnace oil as fuel at pellet plant and 7 megawatt captive power plant at blast furnace unit which uses surplus blast furnace gas. 
The Pig Iron Complex was commissioned in February 2001 with an annual capacity for production of around 2.16 lakh tons of pig iron. Today, KIOCL is capable of producing pellets, both in hematite and magnetite, as a result of the constant and dedicated research work of the company's technical experts. A quality conscious, eco-friendly and customer-oriented company, KIOCL has been conferred with ISO 9001 Certificate for Quality, ISO 14001 for Environmental Balance, OSAS 18001 for Occupational Health and Safety and IS-49001 for Vigilant Services. KIOCL believes that development and environment can coexist. The greenery in and around KIOCL plant is one of the major thrust areas. Greenery is well developed with regular plantations. Water sprinklers have been installed to contain dust. As a socially conscious corporate, KIOCL is actualizing the CSR projects, particularly in the area of education, drinking water, infrastructural needs, community development, women empowerment, public sanitation, and health care, etc. Land is going to play a major role in the coming days to improve productivity. As per India's uh, steel policy 2017, India is also going to use at least 25% of pellets in their charge mix for 2030. Today we are expanding our business uh, mostly to uh, port based plants, especially to Isaac Bottom on the plant of 1.2 million tons. It may come into operation in the next two years. One more, we are planning to set up plant at Bokara that is integrated under integrated steel plant of sale. And uh, if you see other angle uh, to the expertise, again we are taking one young contract that is our NMDC. We are entering into DI pipes at uh, Mangala that is a forward backward integration of blast furnace. Under backward integration, we are commissioning coke oven and also power plant under forward integration with DI pipes. In two to three years, we are expecting that all the projects what we are expecting now it will come into the operations. So we expect after three years, KIOC again will go back to the golden days of Kudurmuk days. KIOCL, building the nation, pellet by pellet.